What's your name? Emoji sign. Open that app. Where you at? What's your name? Emoji sign. Open that app. Where you at? So to get your DG, what's the name of it? To get your DG LAN tablet flash, you will be needing the correct ROM, which is the firmware in other words. And you'll also need the SP flash tool, which I have here. So you will be needing this, and you will be needing the ROM file for your Digiland tab. This is very important when you are flashing your tablet, especially those Chinese tablet. You will need to look for the model number, which is the L101Q. And then you take that number and you look on Google for the stock RAM or firmware. You should find the file, then you download the file and then you flash your tablet. And this goes for all uh, Chinese brand and other brand tablets as well. As you can see, I downloaded everything in one package. So this is the firmware here. So we just need to load in the scatter file. Let's navigate to the desktop. Let's look for Digilan firmware flash, 100% tested. Then we have to select the scatter file. The scatter file is loading, so we are going to format all plus download. So all we need to do here, we just need to connect our tablet and then we need to press the download button as we connected our tablet just want to let you know that if you're doing this for the first time you will need to install the mtk driver and also i'm not responsible for any damage that you may do to your device do this at your own risk so what i am going to do here i am going to put up the volume on my computer to to hear when the tablet is detected so here we go and basically that's how we do it ensure that you don't unplug your USB cable So as you can see it is finished and it is successful so we can unplug the cable we can now check the tablet to ensure that everything is working so the tablet is successfully flashed and you can see it there so what I'm going to do now I'm going to turn it on as 
Sometimes it may take a time to start up on the very very first start up but it will come on it shouldn't take that long So here we are as you can see the tablet is brand new on the software side so we need to just set up everything and ensure that everything is up and running so here we are so as you can see everything is perfectly done that's how you fix that issue with your digiland tab or other Chinese brand tablet as well.